Welcome back. Throughout tonight's debate, one of the hot topics that was brought up multiple times throughout the evening was the issues of border security and the ongoing threat of drugs being trafficked over the southern border line. Former U.N. Ambassador Nikki Haley said on President Biden's approach to the southern border, a quote, temporary protection status for Venezuelans and quote, you have to go and deport these people so they know it can't happen again, end quote. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis stressed the importance, quote, building a wall across the southern border and he would, quote, tax Mexico for it. Tech businessman Vivek Ramaswamy responded to, quote, we are deluding ourselves. The real false promise here is thinking that we will have dealt with the mental health epidemic in this country by just dealing with the demand side of it, end quote. And on the other side of campus, the Alabama Republican Party hosted a watch party of their own. Our Simon Williams is there now and is joined by Jackson Phillips, a former field director of the state Republican Party, Simon. Is, is this really important? Where you That's right, Kenesha. What an exciting kind of night here in Tuscaloosa. I'm Simon Williams joined by Jackson Phillips, a Jacksonville State student and former field director with the Alabama GOP. Jackson, what a, what a cool, let's start here. What a cool place to start. We're at Skygate here uh, in Tuscaloosa. Behind us is Brian Denny Stadium. Absolutely. And we had a watch party tonight. That's a pretty good, pretty good setup for the whole thing. Absolutely. Uh, I was sticking to somebody earlier, and 7,000 students from UA wanted to be at this debate. And that is so remarkable to me because that just tells you that the younger generation does it. You know, uh, they see this as an opportunity to learn and to know more about who they're actually going to be supporting. I mean, because when you get to college, you get your right to vote. And I think it's so important that we have events like this located in, on campuses, you know, because we, we're seeing now more than ever, college campuses are being politicized in every single way. So, you know, let's bring it to them. Let's show the students really, truly who they're ready for and why they're voting. And at this event here today was a watch party hosted by the State Republican Party. Uh, what would you say the turnout was? I'd say we had you know close to 100 people here uh, from front to back. I think 200 and something people RSVP, and I want to say that in, in between the time of people coming and going, we probably pushed over like 200. And, and it wasn't just you know the cookie spread that people were interested in coming in. They wanted to watch the debate. Right. And, it, and it, it was a cool environment because when we'd come out of commercial break, we were watching the debate, things would quiet down. People yeah. really wanted to watch the debate. Yeah. They, when, when the commercials picked up. It was really uh, chattery. Exactly. People were really excited. Um, you know, being a, a former member of the state party in an official capacity, what does that mean to you that we had this kind of really active participation in this event? It means a lot to me because I've worked in the grassroots field and I've seen, you know, how important that is. This is grassroots. It matters. You know, having people here, that all that matters. And about the event itself, uh, our final question here: having a debate on campus, the debate that we had tonight yeah. featuring these candidates. Why, why is it really cool, and specifically here at the University of Alabama? Because, you know, you would think that Alabama really wouldn't necessarily matter, but the University of Alabama is a you know, renowned campus across the country, so being here, it brings this national spotlight, and these people around here really didn't see that. They, they, they didn't awesome, Jackson. Thank you so much. Jackson Phillips, Jacksonville State student and former field director with the Alabama Republican Party. Kanisha, back to you. All right, thank you so much for your reporting out in Tuscaloosa, Simon.